everyone, this is Valentina from Bad Girls Club Season 10 and Bad Girls All Star Battle Season 2, and I'm rocking with A Connection TV, baby. And you are watching A Connection TV. Hey folks, it's Ari from Real World Explosion, and you are watching A Connection TV. Shut your mouth, chit your mouth, chit chit your mouth. What's going on, world? I'm Wesley from A Connection TV, the network, the one channel on YouTube where we actually adopt similar connections despite our differences, and the similar connections that I'm going to try to adopt are with the various topics that I'm going to talk about on this particular blog video. Now, I don't know about y'all. I just watched Bossip's um, little like rant about Mimi Faust and Nico's uh, sex tape, and um, to be quite honest. <laughs> Um, Bossip, or the chick that's on Bossip that was on this video, uh, basically said that it was an episode that she didn't care about. It was throw up. It was Family Guy's throw up because she had the clips of them throwing up bleh, 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 at the thought of Mimi Faust and Nico having a sex tape. Now, I will say this. Mimi Faust is a bad chick. She got a nice body, okay? Um, she looks amazing on the show when she has all of that makeup on. She looks flawless on the show. Hair be looking right. Mimi is the bad chick on the show. Um, Nico. Nico is a hot looking dude with a hard face. Okay. His body is awesome. Great. Everything about the body, great. Everything about the face is just real hard. Real like I had a hard not life kind of face. Right. No problem. No problem. It's not like we're watching two 90-year-olds having sex. It's not like we're watching, um, shit, uh, Rick Ross and, um, Lil' Kim have sex. It's not like we're, we're, we're watching those two have sex. We're watching Mimi Faust and Nico having sex. Did I really need to see it? No, I really didn't need to see it. But when it came out, I'm like, okay, let me go watch it because I would like to see what they look like naked. I would like to see what their sexual situation looks like only because it was brought up and it was already done. So why not? You know what I'm saying? Like if Rick Ross and Lil' Kid made a sex tape, I would not care to watch it. I wouldn't care to see the links. I don't want to see the pictures. I don't want to see the promo. Even if um, um, Stevie J and Jocelyn Hernandez had a sex tape, I know they, they, they leaked their nudes, but if they had a sex tape, I would watch it. Um, K. Michelle and Johnny Crone, I would indubitably watch that. Yes, indeed, I would watch that. Um, so I'm looking at the sex tape and I'm thinking to myself, okay, Mimi, you should have at least wore some kind of makeup. The face wasn't right. The hair wasn't right. The body was great. Pussy looked awesome. Titties looked nice. The body, everything was great. The ass, round. But the face was fucked up and the hair looked trashy. You know what I'm saying? Then we get to Nico. Nico had a hard knock life, so he got that hard knock life kind of face. Body was righteous. Muscle bound. He had like two round dark circles on his ass cheeks, like on each cheek. It was just a round ass dark circle. Don't really know what that's all about. But I mean, in the pipe game, it looked like it was filling her mouth up. So, I mean, you know, I'm seeing a lot of comments about, oh, Mimi Fowl, she's trash. Oh, this is terrible. Blah, 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 blah. All right, here's what I'm gonna say about this. People making sex tapes, I don't, I don't care. It's like, oh well. And the reason why I say it's like, oh well, is because we know people have sex. 
We know that the porno industry is a multi-billion dollar industry, right? I think it's billions, millions, billions, billions, whatever. Okay, industry. So I hate it when a motherfucker says, <laughs> oh, that's, I would never, oh, that's terrible. All of the chicks that talked about Mimi Faust would bang out Nico. And if they wouldn't bang out Nico, they would suck dick. They would bend over. And they would be up on that heavy ass industrial uh, shower rod that she was hanging off of like she was Spider Woman and shit getting, getting fucked in, in, the, in the coon. You know what I'm saying? And just all these acrobatics and shit. Every chick would do that and every dude would do that. So now when Mimi Faust does it because she has a child. And, and Nico, I don't know. And then one report has said that they were engaged. Another report is boyfriend. I don't, I don't know what he is to her, but whatever the case may be. They want to make some money. Vivid decided to buy the deal, so why not? Why not? You know, people going to want to try to download it. I'm sure it'll be on my Vidster in, in like two, three weeks. I mean, I'm going to be checking for it because I would like to see the full length. I really would. I was really checking the video for Nico, to be honest. I, you know, I, I, I did like the part when he was like bump, uh, munching on her box. I thought that was hot how she lifted it up. That whole like, see the titty area and the whole that cup look hot on a female. The ass is hot on a dude, but the cup, the ass and the chest on a dude, the chest and the cup, the pussy cup. <laughs> On a female, beautiful parts, beautiful parts. I'm just saying. I'm Wednesday from Egan Nation TV. Let me know what y'all thought about this damn video. I thought it was hot. I thought it was way better than Kim Kardashian's and Ray J's. That's just my personal opinion. Day, the trailer for Mimi and Nico was much better than the movie for that Kim did and Ray J did. Just my personal opinion. Day. Click that thumbs up button and subscribe to your boy Egan Nation TV and follow me on Instagram. Shadig.